Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of Persona 5. Now, our exams are coming up very fast, so we might study, we might not. I'm going to see what my instant messages say. Ryuji saying, what you up to? And An saying, strengthening my heart. Of course, I'm going to go for the lady because ladies first, right? So she said, hey, I came up with a method of strengthening my heart, but it's kind of hard to do it myself. Will you train with me? I feel like my bond with An will grow stronger soon. Of course we're gonna hang out with her. Thanks. We'll be going to Inokashira Park. It's really big. Well, let's meet up in Shibuya and head over together. Oh, that's so cool. We can actually go to new locations? That is so tight. A natural respite? Or respite? I don't even know that word. Get away from the stress of city life. Couples often ride boats in the pond. Aw, how cute. There are a number of hangout spots in the city, such as shops, event venues, landmarks, and so on. Confidants will each have their own hangout spot that they like. If you go there with them, your bond will grow deeper than usual. You can find out about hangout spots by having confidants invite you there or by reading about them in books. Try to find as many as you can. Oh... That is really cool. And I read the comment section. I have Nini read the comment section for me just in case there's some spoilers. And she told me that a lot of you guys are telling me to water my damn plant. And I'm going to do it. I promise, guys. I promise I'm going to water it tonight after we strengthen our social link with On. Man, big open places like this are great. I think my training is going to go super good today. So remember how I said before that I want to strengthen my heart? Well, I came up with a way to do it. How's that? You're amazing. Uh, I feel like we shouldn't be on our balls that much. So we're going to say, how's that? Um. I think having a strong heart means you don't let anything get under your skin. So basically, I want you to say stuff to me and I'll try not to get phased by it. What kind of stuff? That's your training? I don't get it. What kind of stuff do you want me to say? <laughs> We've already started. I won't let that hesitation shake me. What is she talking about? I guess I should say something to Aunt. Come on, hit me with your best shot. You're stupid. You're an airhead. You're unique. Let's say you're an airhead. Yeah, 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 and? You're a hard worker. Eh. That response was annoying. Eh. Can we stop yet? Let's say that was annoying. Uh-huh, uh-huh, what else? I like you, I love you, can we stop yet? Oh, we're going right for the lovey-dovey, baby. I feel like love is too strong a word to say to On right now. So let's go low-key and say I like you. Wait. Wait, what? That's cheating! You're disqualified, Z! Huh? Wait, is this how the game is supposed to go? Oh well, on to round two. Yes. Bring it on! Listen to me. This won't help your heart. You're a genius. Obviously insulting her is not going to help her heart, so we're going to tell her that. You know, I kind of feel like this won't make our persona stronger. You think? You're right. You finally get it. You know what? Let's not rub it in her face. Let's just say you're right. Huh, something's not right. Sorry. Oh, sorry. I just got an email from my agency. The next shoot is really far. Wait, what's this at the end? It's a notice saying to pay extra attention to the time and place they tell you. Apparently, some models haven't been showing up at all lately. Then when asked why they didn't come, the models all say they heard there was a change in schedule. It sounds like shoots have been real hectic with all the scrambling they've had to do for substitutes. That's odd. Has that happened to you? Yeah. No, I haven't missed a single shoot so far. Whoa, we got a badass over here. It probably really confuses the staff to see a sub showing up too. Hopefully it doesn't happen to me. Though actually, my first modeling gig was as a sub. That was back when I was still in Finland. My parents didn't have enough models for their event. Oh, she's from Finland? That's pretty cool. I think that kind of explains why her hair is different from everybody else. Oh, haven't I told you? Um. My parents are both fashion designers who put on some seriously extravagant shows. They jump from country to country, so I only really see them for half a year. Maybe less these days. Are you lonely? 
That freedom sounds nice. Yeah. Yeah, I guess I can afford to be pretty relaxed these days. Plus, it would probably be tough being a phantom thief with my parents around, don't you think? It was rough when I was little, though. It was just me and our live-in caretaker. I didn't really have any friends. Wow, that got dark fast. <laughs> Honestly, when I'm modeling, it almost feels like I'm connecting with my parents somehow. It's a nice hobby to have, but I don't think I'd want to make a living out of it. After all, that's where Kamashita first spotted me, and that's how our class started those rumors. Besides, the Phantom Thieves are more important to me right now, you damn right they are. Nobody can be my substitute there. Yes! That's why I need to get stronger. I sense a heightened motivation from on. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Here we go. Let's roll it up. Roll it up. Roll it up. And just chance to perform a follow-up attack if Joker's attack does not down the enemy. All right. Okay. I dig it. I feel it. Oh yeah. When I was little, I used to watch this anime where the main villain was a female thief. She'd lose to the hero every time, but I always thought she was so cool. She wasn't really a good person per se, but she was beautiful, strong, sincere, and even sexy. She always said whatever she wanted, did whatever she wanted. She knew what justice was for her. Sounds like my dream girl. I wanted to grow up to be just like her someday. <laughs> I hope I'm getting closer now, if only just a little bit. Bye. Well, see you later. Hmm, hopefully we can teach her the real way to strengthen her persona, which is whooping ass in mementos and beating people in palaces. Not by calling her all these stupid names. Uh, you're back. Yes, I am back. Exam soon, that bully. Oh yeah, that bully that we beat in last episode. Hey, it looked like the bully at our school has changed. I heard he just got calmer all of a sudden. That was you guys, right? It was the Phantom Thieves all the way, buddy. Huh, I guess we can just leave it at that then. Anyway, I'm just glad the butt of evil has been plucked from Shujin. As for more intel, I'll send things your way when I find them. Yeah. All right, that went well. Keep up the good work. Exam soon. Exams are coming up soon. You're not getting a chump on studying without me, right? Right? If you're gonna do it, wanna do it together? I'm in serious trouble. So what's it gonna be? Do you wanna study with Ryuji? Sure. I'll study with Ryuji. I'll help this little dumbass out. He seems like he needs my help. He needs to get some straight A's. He's probably getting straight F's and D's. So we gotta raise that up a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> I'm starting to get the hang of this. So I guess that's what I do with this one too. Wait, that's no good. Damn it. What'd I mess up on? Try starting over. Maybe a careless mistake. Yeah, start over. Huh. Oh, here. If I just fix this... Whoa, problem solved. You're freaking amazing, dude. Yeah, what can I say? I'm pretty cool. I'm gonna go grab a refill. Solving that question's got me real pumped up. Wanna head back? Guess we should go head home. So what do you guys think? Do you think I'm gonna do well on the exams? I think I still only have rank 1 knowledge, so I don't know if I'm going to get a really good grade. But I think I answered all the previous questions correctly. I think I got like one or two wrong. But I did good guessing, so hopefully we do good in the exams this week. Did Kamashita have a psychotic breakdown? Shoot, I haven't studied at all. Have you heard what's happened since then? This sucks. I pulled an all-nighter last night. Really? Did you get caught? Did you get caught pulling an all-nighter last night? What kind of question is that? I should slap that dude silly. Now then, let the first day of exams begin! Although the line connects A to C, it looks like it leads to B instead. What is this phenomenon called? A mirage? An optical illusion? A stigmatism? Pretty sure it's this one. That sounds about right. Yeah, baby. Let's see, an essay question? This looks tough, but let's calm down and think it through. What is the reason why people see the same thing differently? If how they're seeing things is different, it probably has to do with this kind of information. Auditory information, personal information, visual information. Right, how you see something is visual information. What takes the visual information from your eyes and processes it is the... Brain, stomach, marrow. Of course brain. Right. The brain processes visual information. So the reason why people see things differently is... They have different cognitions, their visual acuity, how accurate the printout is. Different cognitions. 
how the brain interprets the same visual data, how one perceives the world differs from person to person. Oh, this sounds pretty good. Yep. You finished in time. Nice. So we get help from Morgana. That is awesome. Time is up. Put down your pencils and put your hands under your desks. Here we go, guys. Let's day two. Today's the second day of exams. You may begin. Which of the following expressions came from the name of the position that Minamoto no Yoshitsune held? Braggart, magistrate, patronage, hot pot attendant, domineering husband. Okay, um, I have no idea what a braggart is, so I'm not even going to choose that. Domineering husband? I don't even think this guy had a wife in his damn life. And I'm pretty sure it's not hot pot attendant, so magistrate's patronage? That sounds about right, yes! What is the origin of the English word talent? The name of a sum of currency? The name of a saint? The name of an artist? I feel like the name of an artist is a trick answer because why would the name of an artist be talent? That makes no sense. The name of a saint? That actually sounds pretty good. The name of a sum of currency. I'm gonna go with that one. That sounds about right. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, so we are four for four on our answer so far. Now it's time for day okay, three. Class, Today's started. the third day of exams. Go ahead and get started. What did the Greek philosopher Socrates say that evil is born from? Ignorance, desire, curiosity. Pretty sure it's desire. That doesn't oh, no! Ah, oh, dang it. What's the least number of colors needed to paint Japan so no two adjacent areas are the same color? I remember this one. It is bow. Ooh, that sounds about it? right. Yeah, baby! Damn, I got one wrong! I'm just trying to get it all 100%, guys. It's okay. It's only our first exam. I'm pretty sure there are many more to come. But now it's Saturday, and I think that Japanese schools are in session on Saturday. So is it the fifth day? No, it's not. <sighs> So sleepy. I ended up pulling an all-nighter once I realized today's the last day of exams. You? Staying up studying? Nah, I gave up on the exam. I was playing some games, then before I knew it, it was morning. I know that feeling. You're failing for sure. How manly. You know what? We're gonna go savage mode. Eh, it'll be fine. Nobody's expecting anything from me, so I don't gotta worry about grades. Ah, <sighs> morning. Yo, look who else is yawning. Shit, I'm yawning. Exams are almost over, so I thought I'd make one last minute effort across the finish line. Mm. Impressive, Lady On. You're quite different from the stupid monkey I know. Huh? Don't give me that crap. Your brain's tiny compared to mine. Size is meaningless if there's nothing inside, you know. What was that? Ugh, will you please shut up? You're gonna make me forget everything I memo- Huh? Huh? Am I imagining things? What's wrong? <laughs> you need the bathroom? What's wrong, baby? What? You see a groper or something? No, that's not it. It's nothing. <sighs> what? Bad. <laughs> hey, at least act like you care. <sighs> Fine. Come on. Hey, uh, are you sure it's him, or are you just that self-conscious? <laughs> Not that- Is there something you want? <laughs> That's my line! You are the one stalking me! Stalking you? That's outrageous. I know you've been <laughs> following me, ever since the train! That's because... That's because you're so hot! 
My goodness. I had wondered why you left the car, so this is where your passion led. All is well that ends well. <laughs> That's the guy from uh, the police file photo that we saw. The one that the lady showed us when uh, Z is in that little interrogation area. I saw That's you the from guy. the car, and I couldn't help myself from chasing after you. I didn't even notice the calls from Sensei, but thank goodness I caught up to you. Okay... What? You're the woman I've been searching for all this time. Please, won't you? Whoa, calm your boner down, buddy. W wait a minute, I... Be the model for my next art piece. M model? All that I've drawn till now has been lacking, but I feel a passion from you unlike anyone else. This man's highly suspicious! Ain't this a recruit for some shady business? Will you cooperate with me? What do you say? I say no. no. Hold your horses! Who are you anyways? Oh, where are my manners? I'm a second year at Kosei High's Fine Arts Division. My name is Yusuke Kitagawa. I'm Motorame sensei's pupil, and I am being allowed residence at his place. I'm striving to become an artist. Huh? Do you mean that, Matarame? The one who was on Good Morning Japan the other day? The very same. You know who that is? He was introduced as a super famous Japanese-style artist who's been recognized all over the world. Uh, but we heard that name the other day in Mementos. Yusuke! I'm sorry, Sensei. I'll be right there. That old guy's Matarame? Matarame Sensei's exhibition will begin at the department store near the station tomorrow. I'll be there to help out on opening day. Please come by. It'd be great if you could give me your answer in regard to being a model then. I bet you have no interest in the fine arts, but I'll give you tickets too. Well then, I hope to see you there tomorrow. I don't like this guy. Why is he talking down to me and Ryuji? That guy's as easy to read as a book. I don't like that. You're not planning on going, are ya? I think I will. Crap, look at the time. I'll see you later. Look at Ryuji's face. <laughs> He's so How extra with the facial expressions. He's just like... Oh, here we go. I knew that was the guy that we saw. When Sai is showing us the next victim or the next person that we changed their hearts, it was the guy Matarame. You became acquainted with Matarame's pupil by chance? That's a little too convenient. It makes me wonder if you're even telling the truth. So be it. What I want to know most is your method. It's true that Matarame was an unforgivable criminal worthy of the scorn thrown at him. He was an adult who cultivated his own fame and fortune by sacrificing the livelihood of children. But how did you discover such horrible deeds that were hidden all these years in such a short time? In the metaverse? I don't remember. Even if we say in the metaverse, she's just gonna think that we're cuckoo. But it's the honest to God truth. This metaverse business again? Yes. <sighs> Fine. Let's suppose that people's hearts can be changed by stealing their treasure, like you've said. Uh-huh. If so, a different suspicion arises. People have gone mad or lost consciousness never to recover, like the subway accident in April. Depending on how you look at it, that could be taken as a phenomenon for a sudden change of heart, too. Were you related to those as well? Mm-mm. I don't want to say. I don't know. We weren't involved with that, though. I don't want to say. Hmm. I see. Why can't we just straight up say no? <laughs> Fine. Continue telling me about Matarame's case. Keep it concise and only of the truth. So Matarame sacrificed children to boost his own career. I wonder what that's all about. Today's the last day of exams, huh? Hey, you stopped writing. Get it together! This is a disaster. You're gonna be in trouble if you don't start studying regularly. That's true. 
So I'm not even gonna get one of the top grades in the whole class because my knowledge is only rank one. Aww. It's over. Yeah, let me stretch too. It's over. It's over. How about you? I'm feeling confident. It's over. I'm not worrying about it. Yeah, let's agree with them. It's over. Come on, you two need to get your act together. Anyways, can we stop talking about the exams? Like it or not, they're gonna come back graded next week. Rather than focus on stuff that's over with. What are you looking at? The usual site. It's no use. There ain't any useful info. The number of posts are getting less and less, too. I am not letting this end as a one-hit wonder, okay? There's no point in getting antsy, though. I know. Why don't we go eat lunch somewhere? We still have some money left over from the other day. I want sushi then. Or domestic raised eel. Ooh, sushi sounds so good right now. We don't have that much left. Oh, right. There are those tickets to Matarame's exhibit. Wait, that's tomorrow. Matarame. Don't tell me. I like that name. Was it love at first sight with that Yusuke guy? Hell no. It's not like that. Fuck that oh, guy. Of course not. When I was watching that special on TV, his artwork was pretty nice. Plus, we've got free tickets. Oh, so she's just using him. Okay. Besides, this could also be related to what we heard in Mementos. Matarame, was it? I'm curious, too. It may be a coincidence. I don't know. Eh, I'm pretty curious. Hmm. I like that thing that Z does whenever you pick an answer. He goes like, I don't even know what that means. But I like it. That aside, what should I do about the other two tickets? Wanna go appreciate some fine arts for once? <laughs> yes. Fine arts, huh? I suggest we should all go together. Appreciating the fine arts builds character. A phantom thief who can't identify an original is lame. Well, if everyone's going... It's settled then. I'm looking forward to it. I'm not interested. Let's see what happens when I pick that. It'd be worth it once in a while. It sounds like it'll be useful for phantom thieves too, you know? Yeah, yeah. It's decided then. We're going. I'm forced. Let's meet at the exhibit entrance tomorrow. I'm being forced to go, guys. How do you guys feel about knowing who the next person's gonna be, by the way? You know how the game takes place in the present and the story is being told from the past leading up to the present? Okay. How do you guys feel knowing that Madarame was gonna be the guy before we even met him? Because we saw the picture when Sai showed us the case file. We knew that it was gonna be some old guy with slick back hair. I thought he was gonna be like some karate master, but he's just an artist. Tomorrow we go to that exhibit with Lady On. I'm curious to know if this Madarame has anything to do with the name we heard in Mementos. Whatever the case may be, we can't be late. Better get to bed early. But first, I'm going to water my plants. So I keep thinking about what Nakanahara said. Could he have been talking about the famous artist Madarame? That sounds about right. Seconded. Great. The name really stood out to me. Yeah, I mean, you guys ever heard of someone else called Madarame? That's a good point. It's not really common at all. If what we heard was true, Kitagawa-kun is studying under a corrupt teacher. You mean a teacher who treats people like tools? Kitagawa-kun's life is probably pretty terrible. We gotta look into this. Before we do that, we gotta water our plants. We thought it looked nice, but it looks a bit dead. No, come back to life. Don't they sell nutrients or something that'll bring some color back to it? Yeah, we go get that. Hey! Can you go out another time? You should rest up after you finish your exams. What? Oh, whatever. Hey. Fine, we're gonna go to sleep. And then we're gonna go to the Matarame exhibit and we're gonna find out what's going on because this guy is definitely suspicious. And let's see what people are saying here. Isn't it just a prank? We heard that one before. Get the fuck out with that shit. <laughs> yeah, these people, these freaking trolls. Oh, the exhibition must be opening today. It's really packed. Want to come back another time? I want it, but it's so expensive. Maybe I should take out a loan. I want to see that. Let's go together sometime. So crowded. It'll be a pain in the ass if someone sees you, so don't stick your head out too much, all right? You came. Um, yeah. You really came. What'd you expect when you left us those tickets? 
Make sure that you don't get in the way of the other visitors. Come now, I'll show you around. I'd like to speak more about the picture I'd like to draw, too. Well, see you guys later. I feel like he's using this later artist on, stuff right? as an excuse, and he's what just trying to get with on. behind some painting and try something funny? I told you not to come out. Yeah, Are we really gonna there. appreciate the fine arts? Can't we just go home? Let's learn about Madarame. We should look around. I want to stay. Well, I don't want to stay, but we gotta find out about Madarame. I guess we should do a quick pass through at once. Uh, which way are we supposed to start? There hmm? he is. It's that old man from the other day. We continue to be truly surprised by your imagination. You have such expansive styles. It's hard to believe that it all stems from one person. Where in the world does all your inspiration come from? Well, it is rather difficult to put into words. They naturally well up from within my heart. Like bubbles rising one after another in the spring. Naturally, you say. What's important is to distance oneself from worldly desires, such as money and fame. My atelier is a modest shack, but it is more than enough to pursue true beauty. You can tell Madarame is the type of guy who likes to listen to himself talk. A shack? He probably strokes it to pictures of himself. I see. So the act of emptying one's mind gives rise to inner beauty. Still, to think we could hear the word shack coming from the great artist Madarame. You would understand if you saw it. <laughs> Wasn't the word shack something? Madarame-san is actually here? Over there! Oh, groupies! I'm so glad I came on opening day! Groupies! Holy shit! Hey, stop pushing! Is this guy that Way famous? Too many people! I'm getting crushed! So many yeah, fangirls! We gotta head for the exit! Don't die on us, alright? I didn't know there were so many types of Japanese art. Usually, one concentrates on their own style. However, since he creates all this by himself, he's special. There you are, Yusuke. Sensei. Ah, the girl from yesterday. Are you enjoying the exhibit? I don't know how to put it into words, but it's really amazing. You're sensing something from the artwork. That alone is enough to give us artists' satisfaction. I hope this becomes a wonderful piece, Yusuke. Well then, if you'll excuse me. You'd imagine artists would be difficult to approach. But he seems really friendly. Yeah, he actually does. Like, I'm not getting any type of weird vibe from him. So whatever he's hiding in private must be some fucked up stuff. Indeed. Because he seems like a really nice guy. Seems like a guy I'd have a beer with or something. Oh, this is it! The painting I wanted to see in person! And I don't even drink beer. Beer tastes nasty. This one? I guess it's the painter's anger? I'm not sure, but I sense this... strong frustration from it. To think such a cheerful and gentlemanly person could make such a piece. <laughs> something wrong? Don't mind me. There are better pieces than this one. Come now, this way. Hey! Ah, that old lady totally elbowed me. Thanks to that, I remember now. About what? Wait, what about On? Let's not worry about it for now. We left her with that fuckboy. It's about a post online. Here, look at this. Why'd you leave without me? Hey, I didn't leave you. you Ryuji did. Wrong. We got dragged into this huge crowd, and eh, anyways, you gotta look at this too. This post might be about Madarame. What's it say? A master of the Japanese arts is plagiarizing his pupil's work. Only his public face is shown on TV. Plagiarizing? I didn't think much of it when I first saw it, but hearing Shaq and Madarame triggered it. His treatment of the pupils who live with him is awful. 
He teaches nothing and bosses them around. He treats them inhumanely, as if disciplining a dog. Abuse on top of plagiarism, huh? So that's what he's hiding. If this is real, it'll be a huge scandal. I wonder if Kitagawa-kun posted this. I Maybe. mean, he is a pupil of his. Who knows? It's anonymous and all. In that case, it's possible the Madarame we heard about in Mementos is referring to the same one. A man like that doing such a thing? I wonder if we can ask that shadow from earlier about this. Oh, actually, we just need to talk to him in reality. And how are we gonna go about that? Are we gonna explain it all, starting with Mementos? Besides, if we make a move out in the open, there's the possibility that Madarame will find out. Oh, yeah, right. Hey, what do you think about Madarame? Doesn't he seem suspicious? He does. That post might be fake. I don't know. I doubt that it's fake because Madarame is the guy that we need to change of his heart. Uh, he does seem a little bit suspicious. He's too I perfect. Know, right? This you know? fits way too well to just be a coincidence. Like, sometimes when you look at a person and you're like, that person's way too perfect. They must be hiding something. That's definitely the type of guy that Madarame is. If this post is legit, ain't this the kind of target we've been waiting for? Mm hmm Well, yeah, but is it really true? By the way, what did you do about the whole modeling thing? Kitagawa-kun gave me his contact info and the address to his sensei's atelier. He said he lives there, right? Perfect timing. Let's try ah, going tomorrow. Ah, that is to perfect timing. Right after school. Huh? You want me to model tomorrow? Mm -hmm. This is too sudden. I gotta see on modeling too. Whew, I bet it'll be good. What? We're just gonna go talk to Kitagawa. Oh, that's what you meant. That's not what I meant. I want to see on doing some modeling, like right now, right here, right now. Okay. In any case, we need to find out if that rumor about Madarame is true. If it is, this might be exactly what we need. Can I go anywhere? Because I need hey. nutrients for my plants. Morgana's always cock-blocking me. Let me do what I want to do. Let my dick swing, Morgana. Jeez. Phantom thieves going by train. This ain't any different from how I get home from school, you know. The train is the fastest way to go. Plus, we can bring pets on here. No! Hey! Who are you calling a pet? Dude, be quiet! We didn't pay the pet fare! I'm the one guiding you to your destination! You should be calling me Master! Hey! Oh, kitty! Uh, shoot! Is that your pet, mister? I heard a meowing! It's a stuffed animal, you're imagining things, it's just a creature. It's a stuffed animal, little girl! Yeah, it's just a toy, it meows when you press on its head. Hey, you heard her, Z. Press on its head. This is ridic- <laughs> Wowie! Again, again! I should press gently. I'll press forcefully. Time to button mash! <laughs> oh, Z. <sighs> That's so funny. I want to hear it again. I just threw up in my mouth. Seriously? The next stop is Shibuya Shibuya. Doors will open on the left side. Oh, this is our stop. We'll see you later. Bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. Is that it? That's it. We're at the right address. That's the place. The door plate does say Madarame. For a famous artist, this looks pretty shitty. Uh, you ring the bell. Me? The walls won't collapse when I do, will they? <laughs> no one sneeze or we'll blow this house down, okay? Oy. I get it. The house sucks. You don't gotta make fun of it all the time. Who is it? Sensei is currently... It's me, um, uh, It's Takamaki. I'm here to model for you. I'll be right out. People really do live here. takamaki that was fast. You two are here as well? Hey. He probably thought that she was alone so he could get freaky. Sorry, but uh, 
We ain't here to talk about the modeling thing. There's something we gotta ask you. Is it true Madarame's plagiarizing stuff? He's abusing people too, yeah? Are you serious? I'm dead serious. We read about it online. This? <laughs> oh, that's an evil laugh. Preposterous! Not only is the plagiarism impossible, but abuse? If he hated children so much to harm them, he would never allow pupils into his home. And I'm the one residing here and studying under him. I'm saying it's not true, so it's beyond doubt. No need to get so defensive, bro. You might be lying about it. Yeah. That... that is utter rubbish. You're utter rubbish. I had no family when Sensei took me in and raised me into what you see now. If you continue to ridicule the man I owe my life to, you will rue this day! You really think that? Yusuke? What's the matter? I heard you yelling. These people are slandering you with baseless rumors. Forgive them, Yusuke. They must have heard some bad rumors and came in worry for their friend's safety. <sighs> Understood, Sensei. Well, even I doubt that a cranky old man like myself could be liked by everyone. That's not what we meant. I'm sorry to have butt in on your conversation. However, I do have neighbors around. Won't you please keep it down? We weren't even yelling, though. It was Yusuke. Now, if you'll excuse me. He was the one getting all hot and bothered. <clears throat> that was discourteous of me. I'm sorry. Better be. I know. I think you'll be able to believe in Sensei if you saw that painting. It's his maiden work, as well as his most representative piece. It's titled Sayuri. Hey, I have a cousin named Sayuri. Sayuri? This was the painting that inspired me to become an artist. It's so beautiful. Eh, it's okay. I don't know all this fine art stuff, but even I can tell that this is impressive. When I first saw you, I felt the same powerful emotion as when I saw this painting. Me? I wish to pursue beauty like this. This guy's smooth. You know, this guy's real smooth. And I believe drawing you will be part of that pursuit. I implore you, seriously consider my offer. I'm sorry that you took the time to come all this way, but I must assist Sensei today. I hope that we can discuss this further another time. If you'll excuse me then. Those two seem like nice guys, don't they? They seem a little Maybe too nice. Maybe the Madarame we heard about in Mementos is a different person. Man, right when we thought we found a new target too. How's the MetaNav? Oh. Hey, the app. Was it picking up our conversation? This display. It means that Madarame has a palace too, right? Mm. But why? Because he's Madarame, evil! Plagiarism, and then Shaq, huh? These seem to be the keywords. For real, though, what the hell's going on? Does an old man like him really have a palace? We have the person's name and the location. All that's left is the what that Madarame mistakes the shack for to enter his palace. You mean, like how Kamoshida thought the school was his castle? That's right. Let's try saying some things. They can be random guesses. It's a bit sudden, though. Why don't we start with castle? No candidates found. Then what about prison? No candidates found. Ah, what a pain! Jail! A warehouse and guidance counseling office. Might as well add farm. <laughs> no candidates found. Not a single hit. Why Should would it be we farm? Come back another time. A building that's related to artists. If we think from there, what would it be? Art school, art supply store, museum. Forgetting navigation. navigation. Whoa, really? Of course. We found it. 
We found Madarame's palace. Of course he's gonna think of his shack as a museum, because doesn't an artist always want their art to hey, hang wait. up in a museum? Hey, when did you activate the nav? You surprised me! You didn't have much of a choice. I think we just happened to get it right. What if I hadn't noticed, and then wandered off and got caught by an enemy? Come on. You probably would have figured it out once you started walking on two legs. Hey. So even you can slip into the metaverse without realizing it, Morgana? Yup, in a place with minimal cognition distortion, the differences can be subtle. What? Forget that. Look! Whoa. That shack is seriously some kind of museum? Hey! Let's go check it out! I think it's so cool how each boss has their own palace. Like, it makes me excited for the next few bosses that we're gonna face. It's because this so is fucking awesome. To the point that it's gaudy. It's a museum, right? This is Matarame's? A palace is a scenery driven by desires. Just like how Kamoshida's palace was a castle. Right. Madarame's artwork is on display at museums in reality too, though. His exhibit was popular, and people already respect him. Why would he fantasize about a museum? You got a point. It ain't related to plagiarism or abuse either. Let's try looking around. Racking our brains here won't do us any good. Right. That aside, ain't a museum a must for Phantom Thieves? Yeah, definitely. There are probably traps, too. Definitely. Now that's our Joker. I feel the same. But man, just look at that insane crowd. Alright guys, we have found Madarame's palace. We are gonna snoop around and find out what's inside in the next episode. We found out that An had a stalker and yes. his name is Yusuke and he wants to use her as a model in his next artwork. And I forgot to water my damn plant. But I'm gonna do all that in the next episode. So if you guys wanna see that, make sure you give this video one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is the dude! <laughs>